The fascination of judo lies in that a person of a weaker physical strength can defeat an opponent of a larger build. Judo is a simple hand-to-hand -hand fighting technique devised by the unarmed for the purpose of self-protection. The main character of judo is to throw an opponent and to make him unconscious by pressing tightly on his neck. To master such techniques is not easy. It goes without saying that the indispensable factor in judo is the training of the body. Yet that is not enough. It is vital that the mind is adaptable to the training of the body. Both pain and agony to the body and mind are basic to the training in Budo. Discouragement only means the defeat of the mind. One does not quickly learn that Judo teaches only through pain and effort. Otosu, or fall, is a term used in judo which means to make one's opponent unconscious. Should one lose consciousness through an opponent's momentary violent pressure to the neck, choking him, he will die if left alone. The student of judo strives to improve both his mind and body, constantly aware that his very life is in the balance. To attain the black belt is but a symbol of having passed the first chapter of the philosophy of Budo. If one becomes self-conceited about his black belt, he will in no time be defeated by one greater than he.
judo has been officially adopted as an entry in the Olympics and has today become an international sport. It must be emphasized that to win, one must learn not only the principles of the art, but the formation of the mind.